I'm Chef Charles Draghi, chef and owner of Herbaluche Restaurant in Boston, here with one of the glories of the sea, fresh sea scallops. These things are absolutely wonderful, and they're even better when they're whole in the shell, rather than just the, what's the adductor muscle, the white part of the scalp we normally call. So in order to take a sea scallop and open it up, it's like opening a lot of uh, bivalve shellfish. It's very simple, you just need a good knife. So what you want is a thin, uh, flexible fillet knife with a fairly long blade. This is about a seven inch blade. And you want to take the uh, scallop with a cloth so that you don't hurt yourself. And um, you're going to go in, they gap like this, and when you put the knife in, they'll clamp down on the blade, so you want to be careful. That strong white muscle is right about here in the middle of the shell. So what you're going to do is you're going to bend the knife and try to cut that muscle and release the top part of the shell. So I'm going to go in from the side, and he's clamping down, and just sort of saw a little bit, keep it wedged open. I've cut through, now the top part of the shell comes right off. So this is the scallop with the bib, also known as the mantle, on the outside. It's a beautiful orange-red row. This is what we normally call the scallop or the adductor muscle. And then this is the belly. The belly you don't want, it has a lot of grit and sand in it. So what you do is just take the tip of the knife, and this is sort of a pouch. So you can kind of just, with your finger, lift this up and just snip it off with the tip of the knife. And we're going to just remove that portion, like that. And we'll set that aside here. And what you want to do is you want to uh, take underneath the row here, with the mantle there's a little section of gills, and you can see them, they look like little feathers. So you just want to kind of clip that, because that will sometimes have a muddy flavor. And you're just going to remove that. It's very soft, comes out very easily. Okay. So you have the adductor muscle, the scallop, the row, and the mantle. They each have a different texture. So I like to leave this fastened on the bottom part of the shell because that way this part of the, the scallop has a nice firmness, a meatiness. There's going to be a softness to the row and a little chewiness to the mantle, which is almost like calamari. On the top half of the shell, you have the other part of the mantle. So you can just remove that. And that'll also have some gills. Just remove that. And put that back onto the scallop. Some scallops may have a little bit of grit and sand. They might not. If you feel a little bit of grit or sand, you can just simply rinse this under a sink and wash that away. This one feels great, looks beautiful. It's ready to be cooked.